We're here in London, Dean Bank Precision. These guys do a lot of finished work and they need EDM machines. They embrace Sodic. Let's find out why. Phil, thanks for the invitation to come into Dean's Bank today. Now, you're a general subcontracting company, but what areas do you actually cover? We cover um, very high precision uh, tool making uh, facilities for various companies around the world. Uh, we do a lot of international work and uh, mainly in the UK sector, we're doing a lot of aerospace work now uh, that we've just started to touch on. and. Um, that is one of the biggest percentages that I see the rise of, of where our company is going to be. And, and will you be sort of just searching for aerospace or other technology transfer sort of sectors? No, it'll be definitely uh, other sectors that we'll be looking at. Uh, we won't be solely looking at aerospace. Um, I think it's important to keep in depth um, a whole range of companies and sectors. On behalf of Sodic, we're here to talk about why you invest in Sodic machines. Why do you buy the, the EDM machines from Sodic? I've worked with Sodic uh, all my working career, uh, 35 years. Um, my experience of Sodic are absolutely on par with anything out there. Their reliability, their accuracy, and their surface finish from now on their new machines is just unbelievable. I see that you've got an old 320. Is, is this why you've sort of gone further into buying the SL400? Yeah, I mean, we, our customers are looking for better surface finish, better accuracy, and us as a company, we're looking to develop that so that we can keep the longevity of our company um, on par with what's out there. And the sort of controls on the new machines, as you, as you see here, are they easy to use? Very, very simple. They're very much, a lot of the traits from the older machines are very much uh, in today's configuration. And yeah, they're pretty simple to use. And the service and backup that you actually get from Sodic, you know, how does that compare with any other machines that you've got at Dean's Bank? Second to none. Their service department, they're on the phone. Um, if I have a problem, nine times out of ten, I can solve the problem on the phone. And if we have to have an engineer out, it's a couple of days down. And the type of work that you're actually doing, is it all about surface finishing? Not really. Um, a lot of it is real high accuracy, uh, high end stuff. Uh, but surface finish, without a doubt, this brand new machine is just turning out the surface finish. I can boast to customers look what we can achieve and they're really really impressed. So the type of work that you obviously are trying to grab now will you think that you'll be expanding by buying new Sodic machines? As and when the um, the kitty is full then uh, definitely we'll be looking at uh, investing in more machines. Um, this is a big investment for Dean Bank but it's a well worth investment. Phil you've had the uh, Sodic 320 for some 13 years. Now you've got the 400, has the transition in reference to the learning curve of the control panel, is it easy? Yeah, extremely easy. Within hours of the machine landing on our doorstep, I was operating it. But uh, as soon as training came in, he didn't have to show me an awful lot. I was using the machine to its uh, high potential. With the investment for the future, is there any reason why you wouldn't consider using any other type of EDM manufacturer? Not a hope on this planet. I've had experience with other EDM uh, manufacturers. Um, I believe Sonic is one of the best out there, if not the best. Phil, thank you very much. Thank you very much.